your strength and show me your weakness We're in this together now We're in this together now Give me your love and tell me your secrets Cause we're in this together now Yeah, we're in this together now Falling down, even if we're falling down, all of me is yours, every part of me. Cause we're in this together now, you and me together now. What's the point of for a nice walk I cleaned the kitchen I made pancakes and eggs for breakfast I don't know why I just was in the mood to make pancakes and I actually made them really good today they tasted different I don't know why but they were delicious so I made pancakes I did a quick little instacart order from sprouts to grab a few things that we needed coffee being one of those things I fed my starter I love freshly cleaning my jars I I hate when the jars are all crazy so every so often I like to just pour all my starter into a bowl and mix it in there clean my jars and then add them back in and it's just a nice crisp clean starter jar you know I don't know what else I have planned because I actually even though we sat down me and Nate have been talking a lot this morning so it was actually a very slow morning compared to my usual mornings but I do have a little bit of cleaning to do I need to vacuum and mop so I usually would have definitely done this already but we have someone coming to check on the wall and stuff all the saga of the leak we haven't had a leak 
So that's good, but now they're coming to repipe and then we gotta come to patch up the walls and all the stuff I've been talking about for the last few vlogs. So I didn't want to clean the floors just to have someone come in and mess them up. But that was so nice. He took off his shoes, he put on booties, he was a one so it made the process a lot smoother and a lot easier so i'm just going to do a little bit of cleaning up freshening up these floors mainly and then i don't know i don't know what today is. um I don't know. <laughs> a, like food prepping video, I just want to share some things I prep for the week, especially because I cook a lot from scratch, and that requires preparation. Um, there are some things that are quick that I can kind of do on the spot, but for the most part, I try and get ahead of things, especially if I'm baking, like baking sourdough stuff. You need to be ahead at least 24 hours. So I just um, would like to share a video just kind of showing some food prepping, some things I have to get done during like Sunday in order to have a successful week and yeah so that's gonna be the next video and I'm looking forward to it. I'm gonna enjoy this coffee back in these floors and then I'll check back in. But welcome here subscribe down below if you're new. My name is Johnny's and I made a really good one. I'm done. Some people when they write for their seven moments, they do like that. That's it. I don't know what's on your mind. You made my one even thicker. Right, the next one. There's no way I can fix it. Oh, no, 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 something which I'm very proud of I did have to set an alarm but um, I did wake up at 5 because I had editing to do so I've been up for a while 
and that ran up until like basically I was editing up until it was time to make breakfast so definitely didn't get around to working out I didn't get around to reading my bible but I feel okay because I've just been so consistent with that for the last couple of weeks and um just with what I needed to do today I'm okay with you know my routine this morning kind of being a little off but hoping to oopsie, hoping uh you know just to get back into that tomorrow no, I'm so excited because I ordered a bread machine finally got it it comes Sunday so we have a couple days I don't know why it wasn't two day it was on prime but the earliest was getting it Sunday so and some of the other ones were even longer like not until the 30th and I was like no I want it <laughs> I would have liked it today but you know whatever so that's going to be coming in on Sunday and I'm hoping it comes fairly early because Sunday I want to film a homemaking like meal prep cook from scratch food prep kind of video just to like just share kind of the staples so I'm gonna make this into like two buttons so yeah I'm, I'm excited for the bread machine to come on that day so that I can utilize it in that video because I always have lots of bread to make and I'm specifically gonna have lots to make because we ran out of all of our bread this week and I was gonna do like make it earlier but I did want to save it for that video just to kind of share um, kind of what we have prepped but yeah we ate the last of the sourdough um, this morning as he ate the last English muffin a couple days ago I ate the last bagel a couple days ago so we like are literally out of bread so it is that time to restock what if we had a and I'm looking forward to that video so stay tuned bagel. for that that should be up be cool next Friday <laughs> this if I have another girl she's gonna be bold cuz if her hair is anything like this cuz she has I think she has Nathan's texture she sure as heck ain't got mine can you guys see this like, what is this what is this, this is Botanicals oat milk and calendula sensitive and soft, gently nourishing, sensitive hair detangles and softens. Um, moisturizing conditioner. What?
No, across from you know, the stereoscope. Well, well, you know, the stereoscope is like, not this This is a common place for A blanket of this history covers oh, me. That's where I went to it. yesterday but after we were at the park and everything we had a nice just run and outdoor time came home me and this one actually fell asleep because I we actually stayed out on the balcony for a while where she was playing with midnight I was cleaning the balcony because it just needed to be cleaned because midnight had been out there and I gave him a bath and we've had him inside um, Nathan got home a little later like an hour after that and we got food this one fell asleep so me and Nathan just kind of relaxed the rest of the evening today I got up early actually I woke up at 5 maybe 5 15 this morning um, and I just went ahead and fed my starter because I knew I wanted to get some sourdough dough going today um because tomorrow i'm filming a whole separate video on like a sunday meal prep kind of video so i just wanted i usually obviously it takes 24 hours for sourdough bread to proof and everything so i want that to be ready for tomorrow to bake i read my bible me and nathan, uh, me, and nathan <laughs> me and midnight <laughs> went out on a run which was nice an early morning run it was like maybe seven this morning um, had a little bit of sunlight, crisp air, and instead of just doing like a regular workout, since it was Saturday, I figured just getting out and going for a run would be nice, and that's what we did. Then I got back, cleaned him up, and then I got started on breakfast. I made us, um, we had biscuits, buttermilk biscuits, bacon, and eggs, so we had a nice little breakfast, some coffee, but we just had drip coffee. I didn't make a latte today because I want to go 
to this cafe called Cafe Coffee Shop. Can you do my phone right there, baby? Uh, it's actually called Cafe FC, and it's in Hacienda Heights, which is about 20 minutes or so away from here. So we figured we'd make a little, little moment of it and just go and get a cafe, or go and get a cafe, go and get a coffee. And the reason we were doing this, <laughs> you're probably wondering why you're driving 30 minutes to go to a cafe, is because this place is like organic, they use real ingredients, no like fake Look. syrups. And the highlight is they use raw milk. So I am so excited to go get a raw milk latte from this cafe. And they have some specialty drinks. I don't remember what I was saying. Um, I'm just really excited to like treat myself but still have something that is like what I would have at home, you know? Mm -hmm. So we're just decided to make a little a little moment of it and go out there. We're gonna see if they have our cocoa and she can have like a little raw milk hot cocoa so we're really excited to give it a try and i'm gonna take you guys along other than that i might end out this vlog after that just because i'm starting a new one tomorrow and i kind of just don't want to um just i don't know get burnt out on filming because i've been filming for the last few days so yeah but if you haven't watched my last video my last video i did a my morning cleaning routine so if you guys are just interested in what i do to keep my space looking clean and peaceful and cozy and how i kind of just start off my day to have a productive start and free of clutter and getting my mind right then definitely check out that video i have it linked down below and let's go get some coffee i'm so excited <laughs> That tastes good. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. just listening to her and we were like just talking about health and like we just aligned on so much stuff and it's just exciting to be able to support a local cafe that has the same just ideas and beliefs and like passion behind like health and wellness and it was just really nice and we took I'll insert some clips because it was a small cafe and they actually had like a steady stream of people. So it wasn't a lot of room for me to really be filming. Like I was in the way of people ordering their stuff. And so I didn't get to get a lot of footage, but it was just nice. We had conversations, Ezzy really liked her. I ended up buying this really cute mug. Let me show you guys. This is the mug. It's a handleless mug. I love these ceramic mugs. She gave me a discount on it, which was really nice as well. And she said they get it from like a local pottery company, I believe. And so it's just so cute. And I saw it and I was like, oh my gosh, I have to get this. And it comes with a free drink, but we had already ordered all of our drinks. So she was like, you don't have to redeem it today. You can come back. So definitely going to be back because I just truly enjoyed the people that work there and just everything. They just everything they have is like really like housemade. She's really passionate about 
just having like loose leaf organic high quality teas nathan got a strawberry the strawberry matcha it was really good i tasted his and i got it was called an orange you glad and it was basically just like vanilla and honey a latte with like a a um citrus spritz and then they put a little orange peel in it and it was just really nice and there was like this hint of citrus and of course we got raw milk and all our drinks as he got a hot chocolate with raw milk and it was so good me and nathan both took a sip of it and she ended up telling us that one of the guys that works there his mom makes the it's like a mexican chocolate like it's made like really traditionally and like it was just so good <laughs> that's the best way i can explain it and i don't know i just really enjoyed talking to them and so um yeah i was like definitely we'll be back we took shots of kefir because they also use raw farm which is the brand i use of raw milk and raw butter and all the raw stuff um i've never had raw kefir and our kefir people call it different but i call it kefir um i've never had it but i've heard how good it is high in probiotics and all that kind of stuff and so she, we were talking about it and she was like, oh my God, you guys want to try it? And so we all took shots of it. It was just, it was just a fun time. I'll put in clips, like I said. Cheers. Cheers. Two. Yeah. Because <laughs> I put it on my stories on Instagram. But we ended up just sitting there and staying for a while. Me and Nathan talked a bit, but we also talked to her and it was just a really nice time. So we're back now i'm actually kind of hungry I just finished doing some stretching bolts on my sourdough and for the rest of the day honestly ezzy and nathan are outside right now ezzy's riding her bike um i already had like a lot of a good outdoor time this morning like getting out and running with midnight so i'm kind of just staying inside probably gonna watch something drink some water um and then get ready very soon because it's already 4 30 <laughs> get ready to make dinner and i think we're doing tacos for dinner tonight so that will be nice so that is the plan thank you guys for tuning into this vlog i feel like it wasn't a lot going on but you've seen a little bit of the last uh, few days and if you enjoyed make sure to subscribe down below um, follow me on instagram comment down below follow me on instagram Subscribe if you're new and I will catch you guys in the next one.